Jill Judith Love Cohen, who helped create the abort guidance system which rescued the Apollo 13 astronauts, went to work on the day she was in labor. She took a printout of a problem she was working on to the hospital. She called her boss and said she finished the problem and gave birth to Jack Black. That is one legit till. Never even heard of this. Her boss, of course, couldn't understand the significance of her giving birth to Jack Black. She did more in that day than I have in my entire life. Jack Black's mother helped the Apollo 13 astronauts get home while she was giving birth to him? Holy beep. Edit, this was before Apollo 13 upon actually reading the article. Greater than asterisk engineer who worked on the Pioneer, Apollo, and Hubble missions asterisk author and publisher of books about women in STEM and environmentalism asterisk ballet dancer with the New York Metropolitan Opera Ballet Company asterisk advocate for better treatment of women in the workplace wow, imagine trying to follow that. No wonder Jack Black is so. Jack Black. Jack That's not how you expect a story to end. He really does end up everywhere. She worked tenaciously. That was a wild ride. The name of that kid? Albie wait what? Those last five words hit me like a ton of bricks. Hearing about a great scientist giving birth to a great artist, comedian reminds me of this John Adams quote. I must study politics and war, that our sons may have liberty to study mathematics and philosophy. Our sons ought to study mathematics and philosophy, geography, natural history and naval architecture, navigation, commerce and agriculture in order to give their children a right to study painting, poetry, music, architecture, statuary, tapestry and porcelain. This is the greatest and best story in the world. My grandma famously had her boss bring an adding machine and the week's receipts to the maternity ward on the day she gave birth to my mom, so that she could balance the books. And so that he could meet the baby, presumably. They were really good friends in addition to their professional relationship. There was no such thing as paid maternity leave in 1962, but her boss did have her work from home for six weeks and then paid for childcare. Grandma lived until 2019 and still told anyone who would listen how great her boss had been. That's the most Jack Black thing I've ever heard. This title is a roller coaster that I'll need to ride multiple times to get a sense of. I picture Jack Black at birth to look exactly the same as adult Jack Black. That post was bananas. A thrill ride to the last word.